Halloween is coming and it's time to consume a dangerous amount of candy. Here is a jack-o'-lantern showing the aerodynamics of it. We have streamlines going from left to right. Oh, I forgot to say, what's up amigos? We're doing jack-o'-lantern today. And as we play, we can see the streamlines coming around and they wrap up into two counter-rotating like little vortices kind of thing. The velocity stays quite slow behind, so it's a fairly wakey object. Some of the streamlines go into the mouth and the eyes, but not many. Most of them actually go around. And this is a wide plane going through the pumpkin. And the flow accelerates around as you'd expect. Around, look at that. Just near the bottom, the flow is really fast as it zips through and then you have a massive wake. And there's quite a slow flow in the mouth and eyes as we saw before. There aren't too many streamlines going in there. So like, subscribe, and share this with your friends. And do you want a super easy way to make your experiments more accurate? It's really easy. Just measure the temperature, barometer pressure, and humidity of the air you are using. Most aerodynamics assume, they assume that the air is 1.2 or 1.225 kilograms on a given day, but it's not. Every day is different. Here are some graphs showing it can easily be two or 3% different every day. So if you want to make your experiments two or 3% more accurate, make your life easy, and get out Atmosphere Hawk. It accurately measures the temperature, barometer pressure, and humidity and gives you a very accurate density. Link in the description. Peace out, amigos.